South Wales, where roads can be narrow like this, or wide like this. We're on an old airport taxiway, St Anthem, home of the South Wales Aviation Museum, an excellent collection of very well kept aircraft. This is the Barrage, Penarth, Cardiff Bay and the harbour. Quite impressive, huge engineering feat. And we got uh, ships coming through at the various tide levels. So this level is the bay level. Come over here, other side of this fence. Not a fence. Once the water has reached the inland level, open the gates and the boats are free to move in. Then close the gates and await the next movement. We're inland at the Brecon Beacons National Park, hiking to Penny Fan, summit at 2,900 feet. Sydney, our son, is joining us. It's a good path, but steep. Busy, as you'd expect on a day like this. Fancy meeting you here. Yeah. Except that I can't jump. Before you reach Penny Fan, there's another slightly shorter summit, Corndu. Everyone's admiring the view, drinking water and preparing for the final push to the top of Penny Fan. I don't know what Sydney's carrying in his rucksack. It looks heavy. A little more about Corn Dew. This is not quite the summit. This is actually 13 meters lower than the summit over there. So down and back up again. Yeah, but we're all here. The views are wonderful, especially between the two summits on a day like this. Plenty of interesting longer trails off the main path. Penny Fan Peak, and a queue if you want the obligatory photo. Or use a zoom lens. We're now at the top of the highest mountain in South Wales. That's our exercise done for the day. Ice cream for everyone.
Carefilly Castle, the largest in Wales and the second largest in the UK after Windsor, has the most elaborate water defences in Britain. You can walk all around the perimeter of the castle and it's a bit windy today. years old. Not too bad la. No fishing from the island, so presumably you can fish from the castle. Hmm, I didn't bring my fishing rod. The entrance. We're not actually going in, we're sneaking through a side door and going round the back. It's cheaper. So this castle <coughs> is 800 years old got a bit of battle damage and has a leaning tower. Not many you can say for that. Down by the moat, we here we have four geese, I think they're Canadian, but I'm not sure, and one gosling. I'm sure there's some more goslings there somewhere else. And they seem to be the main inhabitants, definitely guarding the castle. Some beautiful houses in Carefilly. We are staying in Mountain Ash. The town is named after a tree. The green door is ours. Come inside, let's have a look round. Living room with a small dining table, beautiful decorations. Into the kitchen, small but has everything. The kitchen extends into the backyard, but there's still room for a small garden. Spacious seating 
and a view into the valley. It's a narrow staircase with a rope handrail. The bedroom is more than adequate. The bathroom for an old mining cottage is quite frankly huge. Yeah. 